You got a fish in a trap. You put it together. You got a fish trap. Put the trap together. It what, looks what like a really long fish. No. It's oh, wrapping oh my around. Yeah, it wrap oh, 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 oh. Come here. Look at this. Oh my gosh. What's up, Raw fam, and good morning. Today we're over here at Wally World, aka Walmart, and we're in the fish trap section, as you guys can see right here. There is so many epic fish traps, and guys, you know, they do look like bird feeders, guys, I'm, I'm, I'm not gonna lie, but trust me, they are not bird feeders. No, you're not in the slightest, guys. These are some epic little fish traps, you know, little hole right there. You know, a fish could go in here, um, you know, anything in South Florida could just, you know, kind of, you know, you know, just swim right in. How the heck do I open this little fish trap? And then, <laughs> this is a good one. And then bam, bam, there's a fish in there. Woo! So of course, you know, the proper thing to do is that, you know, there is a bunch of epic little fish traps. We have this little thingy bob right here. You know, whatever the heck that, bro, what the heck? One, two, three, four, five. Bro, this is literally the most epic minnow trap you could, you know, money could buy. Oh, okay. We're putting this down. This is actually like tomorrow's video. This is so cool. So yet again, they have, you know, so many epic little fish traps right here. You know, whatever the heck this thingy mabob is. A de-squirreler, some, I don't even know what the heck this thing is, guys. I'm telling you guys, there's so many epic fish traps at Walmart. You know, it's not, you know, oh, we're not at Walmart. Um, we're at uh, Home Depot, yeah. Get your fish trap at Home Depot. So yet again, over here at Home Depot, we have some, oh, Frank, some, Franklin. Uh, some, we're at, we're at Walmart. Dang it. Okay, yes, you guys caught me. We're over here at Wally World, aka Walmart today, of course. And you know, we have picked out a little fish trap for under $10. Guys, how could you beat that? You got a fish in a trap, you put it together, you got a fish trap, and of course, you know, this is a beautiful little fish trap, guys. I saw this one, and I was like, oh, this is a cool little trap. Let me see if I could, you know, ow, jeez. And then I realized, you guys look really close. Look, there is a little glass, little liner. And I was like, bro, that is the sickest thing ever. And I was like, so how do I, you know, open this? And I start pulling on stuff. You know, it's pretty insane. I was like, I wish the roof just lifted off so I could literally just put bait in there and call it a day. So of course, technically, you know, this is our beautiful little fish trap. Of course, guys, it may look like a bird feeder, but guys, do not let this little fish trap deceive you. Trust me, this is a fish trap. It, you know, a design fish trap to be sold for under $10. There's a bunch of little ornaments, but guys, we are not here for, you know, fish tanks today. We're actually here. <whistles> ding, ding, ding. There we go. So, of course, if we catch, Ow. So if we catch anything inside of our fish trap, it will become our pet. And of course, we will put it in our pet carrier kit. Yet again, if we catch anything inside of our fish trap today, we will be putting it in our pet carrier. Of course, guys, we could catch little frogs. We could catch a massive goldfish. And of course, you know, we could catch anything here in South Florida. Guys, there, you know, oh, I'm at Hawaii. Hawaii. Hey, what's up, Raw fam? So, of course, now we are over here at my neighbor's house, and you know, she sent me something so cool, so crazy, and honestly, I really do not think she knows what she actually sent me, but we're gonna give her a fair shot to, you know, to explain what the heck is going on in her backyard. So, of course, let's go right here. So, of course, we're gonna come right here and introduce ourselves to um, my crazy little neighbor. Here we go. Hello. Is the Raw fam home? Hey! hey. What's up, Audrey? So, of course, you know, this is my neighbor. So, everybody, Raw fam, meet Audrey. Say hi. Hey, Raw fam. So, of course, um, you know, guys, sorry, you're doing, you're doing great, you're doing great. <laughs> so, of course, we're here um, with Audrey. And, Audrey, you have something to show me, correct? Or show, you know, the Raw fam. Yeah, so this morning I was having my coffee and I look over and I see a bird coming with something like, like wiggling. In like his mouth. wiggling in his. Do you, do you know what it was? It looked like chance? a really long, thin fish, but it could have been a snake. A snake? Okay, so Coming you know, from the water. You know, I you know, I kind of hate snakes, but you know, whenever you guys see this footage, you guys are gonna see that you know, this isn't your typical average snake. Do you by any yes, chance have your phone? I have it, yes. You know, this is actually very cool. It's crazy. Let me see. Okay, so she actually has. Hold on. Let me see if I could show you guys this. So kind of zoom in. So what what are you seeing here, Audrey? What do you, what do you, what, it looks what is like that? a really long fit. No, it's oh, wrapping oh my, around. Yeah, it wrapped its around. Beak. It. 
Can, can, wait, wait, can we do that again? Hold up, let's just replay this. Look at this, guys. Raw fam, look at this. It's wrapping around the beak. Hold up, watch this. Oh my gosh. And guys, Raw fam, you know, I love catching eels, okay? There is no way in heck that I would believe that that was a snake. I think that that was a freshwater eel. Um, we've caught them before. You know, that is, you know, not your typical thing in South Florida, but of course, now, thanks to Audrey, you know, an awesome neighbor sending me a video, you know, guys, now we have a new freshwater eel spot, of course. So, of course, we're actually going to be able to go in her backyard right now. She actually gave me permission. Guys, she didn't give you guys permission, so, you know, don't steal my little crazy eel spot or we're going to fight. So, of course, you know, we're going to go right now inside of the backyard and, you know, make our little fish trap. Of course, with Audrey. High five. Down low. Let's do it. Woo. Oh. Too slow, raw fam, but of course, you know, maybe she'll be fast enough in the backyard to get away from this little crazy eel. So let's get back there and go do that. This is just your average, typical canal. You know, your South Florida canal. We got lily pads, we got sawgrass, we got, you know, some boats, you know, cool little stuff. So where did you actually see this thing? Where was the video taken? So actually, I was in there. Wait, wait, what was that? I can't hear you, the camera can't hear you. I was actually having my so, coffee. So that's right where you were having your that's coffee? That's where I was having wait, my wait, coffee. Wait, wait, right that's... there, yeah, okay? So wait, let's line it up. So if you guys come right here, you guys can see, you know, from this little window, you guys can see that we have like a good little view. And you know, she was like right there, right? Right, she like, flew right in here with the like eel. right here? And it's so Ralph, fam, come here guys. We actually have to, um, whenever we look at our surroundings right here, we have to look what looks eely. So as you guys see, you know, I'm looking at my surroundings. We have like a little log right here. You know, that looks pretty cool. Maybe the bird walked over to it, picked up this little eel and, you know, started walking with it and then it went, ah! Is that what it did? It really did, it's just you know, like it, that. It, what did it do, you know? Ah! Like that. Ah! As you guys can see, you know, this is our little area today, guys. We have one mission and one mission alone. Guys, can we catch the crazy critter that is inside of Audrey's little canal? Of course, guys, Rolf, do you guys think we can do it? I know we can, of course. So, of course, let's go get the fish trap in the fish carrier that we got today for today's awesome video. And, of course, we got some epic little food to put in the trap. Of course, I'm going to show you guys everything right now. So, let's do it. So of course, as you guys can see, we have our little, it's not a bird feeder fish trap, guys. Obviously, I told you guys earlier, it is a Home Depot fish trap. <laughs> uh, no, it's from Walmart, let's be real. And of course, as you guys can see, we gotta actually, you know, modify this little bird feeder to where it will actually work in our favor and potentially catch us some eels. So one thing that I really liked about this little fish trap, as you guys can see right there, there's a little lip, okay? Let me see if I can pull this lip out. You know, this lip will actually provide um, a little bit of water flow. So water is gonna be able to go in and out of this trap to actually send scent, okay? Now, the top of this, as you guys can see, you know, it's gonna be open. So then the, the little eels or the little snakes or whatever the heck they are, is basically just gonna be able to swim right in, you know, into the trap and basically we're going to lift up on it. That's gonna fall down and we will have our little eel. Sounds good? Sounds great. Sounds awesome, sounds amazing and it sounds like a crazy, oops, I did not mean to do that. It sounds like a crazy psycho adventure that's gonna start right now. So of course, let's get the trap ready. Ah! It's very stinky. I left this out. Oh. <laughs> Jeez. Okay, so obviously this is a nasty, disgusting bluegill. His eyes are like, ugh. So we're just gonna, I'm sorry, Audrey. <laughs> there you go. So we're, I'm gonna see if I could just, you know, put the little trap, there you go. You know, put the trap together. There we go. So now the trap is actually activated, of course. So basically all we have to do is take this little trap. As soon as the little eel or whatever goes in there, you know, we're not gonna be able to know. We're gonna throw it kind of deep out there. Um, not too deep because we kinda wanna get to, you know, get a good feel. If you guys turn around, um, the one thing that isn't in our advantage um, is because, you know, as you guys can see, if you guys look at the water, very closely there's a very big glare on it today it's all white you know you can't really see into the water correct so today's trap is kind of gonna have to be lucky a little bit um, luck is gonna be on our side but um, how, how long do you think this trap should take you know until we have a fish in there like five minutes five <laughs> she clearly has not done a fish trap before when you're targeting fish like this you know you never know that could have been the only fish in this area or there could be a billion little things in the trap so you know you really never know until you of course try it so now the trap is kind of set we're just gonna you know 
open it up just a little bit, call it a day right there. This is 10 pound test fishing line. You know, obviously there's cables, there's this, there's that, but you know, you just want to be careful so then this fish will not be able to see you, you know, from a long way away. So of course, obviously, as you guys can see, we have our little bit of fishing line on our fishing reel. Of course, now, you know, that fishing line is going somewhere. If you guys look down the rod and look right here, we have our fish trap, of course, sitting right here. Guys, come here, look. So of course, as you guys can see, the fish trap is right here. Our, you know, a little eel or whatever smells it, you know, goes right in, of course. And there we go. Audrey, are you ready? I'm so ready. Set the hook. Yeet! Get it! Woo! There we go. Yeah, wait, 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 wait. Crawl fam, look what we got. Come here. Oh my gosh, we got an eel or a snake or um, a Christmas tree branch. <laughs> ah! Maybe we have to. Is that the bird? No. Oh, <laughs> never mind, Raw fam. Wait, that's the bird. That that's him. It. That's him that's right the there. Bird. See him, guys. Raw fam, do you see him? There's two of them. There's two of them. Woo! We found the mother load. Yes. Raw fam, of course. Guys, come here. What are you guys doing over there, guys? Come close. Guys, we have these beautiful birds. And guys, obviously those birds are up there and they're not down here because they're fat and fluffy, guys. They are full. They are not hungry anymore. They already had their eel a la mon. Today, this morning, guys, you know, that was their breakfast. They had eel um, for breakfast. You know, I wish I had some eel. Audrey, where's the eels at, homie? there I guess I'm in in there we're we gonna get some meal you're gonna cook it up I'll cook it up <laughs> so Audrey are you ready I'm okay ready. so basically what I'm gonna have Audrey do you're gonna throw this as far as she can down there and guys you know these eels these snakes these you know largemouth bass peacock bass anything that's cool that might want to eat our little baby bluegill is down deep in that grass if, as you guys can see I know it's clearing up a little bit if you better look right now there's grass everywhere and that is where these little crazy critters are hiding of course one billion percent sure you know that is why these birds are here so of course Audrey are you ready I'm ready three two you better chuck it <laughs> two one raw fan there we go Woo! okay well you threw it a little too hard honey but no it's okay it's okay we're good we're good we're good okay guys so of course whenever you're converting um, a a bird trap into a little fish carrier um, you know I don't think this thing is little you know literally made for this stuff I guess we can't really use it anymore but didn't we get something else earlier in the video like a fish carrier here you go now we have to convert what we were actually going to keep um, whatever we caught in um, so of course you want to hold this looks like we have to take a little bit of a rock to keep it from floating put that bad boy right there and of course take this little thing and tie it to our fishing line. So of course now we're gonna have to throw this little guy out there with our little bluegill. You know, what's, you ready to throw it out? Let's do it. So you guys ready? We got our bluegill inside of the, the container. There we go. We're gonna let it sink. It's going into the abyss. Of course, Audrey, you ready? You got the rod? Look right here, look right here, look right here. You're good? Yeah. So of course, oh, you're doing a great job, good job. There we go, Rolf fam. So of course we have our little, you know, honestly there's a little bit of glare, but if you guys look right there, I think we could get a good look at what is actually inside of the trap. So of course, Audrey, when do you, you know, how long do you think, you know, a good estimate time is, you know, for this trap to sit? I think like a minute to five minutes. A minute to five minutes. Okay, so let's, you know, convert that into fishing talk, you know, Everybody says, you know, five more minutes of fishing it usually ends up in about an hour. So, of course, you know, we'll give it about 30 minutes. We'll cut it in oh, half. Oh, okay. Awesome. So, we'll give it a 30-minute clock, you know, shot clock down right now, beginning. Wait, wait, do you have a phone? Well, I grab my phone. It's right there. Okay, so we are at 29 minutes and 38 seconds. Of course, are you ready? Are you excited? I'm so excited. You know, what are you going to do whenever this thing comes up and goes? I might run inside. Yo, how much time do we have left? Oh crap. Oh crap, so we're at 8 minutes and 43 seconds. Audrey, let's go! <laughs> she was sitting right there. Ariba, let's go! Run, 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 run! Yeah! Are you ready to catch some fish? Let's right, so do it! How much time left do you think we have? Like 5 minutes? Ah, we got 8 minutes. Oh, what? I'm close. Uh, we were kind of close, so we got, you know, 11... No, 
Eight minutes and nine seconds left. Of course, what do you think we could get? I think today we could definitely get the yeah. snake thing. The snake. The wiggly. The snake looking, fish. eel wiggly looking fish. fish thing. Can you get it down low this time? I did it. She got it. So of course, now we are getting down to the final seconds of today's trap. You know, for the first, you know, the first time we're checking the trap, of course. You know, how many? Okay, so we're down to, of course, let me see. 7, 16 seconds, of course. You ready? I'm you know, ready. you want to do a countdown? Okay, Let's so 10, it. 11, 10, 10 9, 9, 8, 7, 7 6, <laughs> we're, we're, we're a little over. 5, so, 4, four three, 3, 2, 1. Happy New Year! Woo! There we go. Oh, that's the little timer. You guys hear it? No, it, it stopped for some reason. <laughs> uh, we don't need that phone. Um, so you ready? So this is what I need you to do, Audrey. Okay. Um, after a solid 30 minutes of waiting, you know, the sun is finally back out. You know, it was very cloudy before. All of those clouds that are right there, you know, in the last 30 minutes have literally, they were over us. They're literally all the way over there, like five miles away. It's actually kind of cool. So you ready? So what I'm gonna need you to do is you're gonna need to reel this in whenever I get over there. Okay, okay. so what we're gonna do, you're gonna kind of like help me get this thing in, okay? All right. So what we're gonna do, so I walk right to it. I'm gonna grab this fishing line. Guys, come with me. Come on, Royal fam. Ow, ow, ow. Let me see if I can get in there and grab it. Oh, geez, it's getting so deep. Wait, where's the fishing line? Reel up? Oh, there you go. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Here we go. Okay, I got it. Reel it, reel, reel, reel. Boo! Boo! Reel, reel it, reel it, reel it! Oh my god! Audrey, oh. reel it, reel it, reel it! I do not want to touch that! Reel it, Audrey, Audrey, reel it! Oh, 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 oh! Oh! <laughs> come here, come here! Look at this! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! That was it! Oh my gosh! Look, Audrey, look at this! Oh my gosh! Look at this, look at this! We have to open it! We have to. Is this thing gonna bite us? Raw fam, raw fam, is this thing gonna bite us? Hold up, hold up. Ready? Come here, come here, come here, come here. This is your fish. This is your thing. Come I'm here. I'm a little scared. Okay. Look at this, guys. Rolf him. Look at. Ew! Ew! Oh, look at that. <laughs> oh my gosh. No, no, don't go down. Don't go down. Okay, he's going into the grass. No, no, he's disappearing. See, he's doing what. Look, he's literally disappearing. Come back out. No, 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 no. no. He's gone. He's, he's, over, gone. Here. he's, he's over here. He's over here. He's coming he's, out. Oh, oh, come here. Come here. Hopefully, he doesn't bite me. Oh, jeez. Come on, buddy. Stop going in the grass. Oh. Stop going in the grass, buddy. Okay, okay. Oh! Okay, guys, I do not like this thing, guys. I have no idea what the heck this thing is, but of course, you know, I think we need to give him some water. You know, he just got beat up. So come here, guys, come here. Uh-oh, this is gross. Ow, ow. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Okay, he's going back. Bro, he has the bluegill in his mouth. Bro, I, I want to say he has... Look at his look at his throat, bro. Is that the bluegill? See it opening? See that big fat thing right there? That is the bluegill. Guys, this thing is so big that I think it literally just took a chunk out of the bluegill. And I guess, you know, baby, he, he went like this. He went, ah, and like ripped off a chunk because this thing has some crazy little teeth. Look at this thing, bro. That is th it's literally so insane. Hold on, let me see if I can add more water. Audrey, can you hold this? Yeah. Okay, not like the eel. You gotta grab the eel. No. No? Why not? I'm a little scared. Is hold it on. gonna bite me? Let me get all the let me get all the grass out. Okay, what the heck is this thing? Rough them, come here. Let me put it down here. Do you guys see that thing? Guys, comment down below. What the heck? Zoom, bro. Bro, what is this thing? That is so sick. All right, let's zoom out. Let me get some more water so you guys could actually see through the little panels that this thing has. You know, we're gonna go right here. Oh, don't go out, don't go out, don't go out. Oh my gosh. Raw fam, look at him. Look at him. Oh my gosh, that is so cool. Dude, look at his mouth zoom, bro. That is like the coolest shot I've ever seen in my life. Look at him, bro. He's going insane. He's opening his mouth because he's afraid of everyone and he's trying to attack. Look. See him right there? Rawr. Oh, that is so cool. Oh my gosh. Okay, Rolf, and let's see if we could go put this over on that little table right here. Come on, come on, come on. 
I'll drink coffee. Jeez. Film, film, film. Jeez. So of course, these, you know, this is, you know, Audrey, what do you have to say? I mean, th this is, who, he, he was like, bro, I'm gonna attack you. No, he's for, me out. For, you, you sold him out though. She sold him out and of course, now we found the new little eel trap. Oh my gosh. He looks really mad. Look at him. That is an eel, guys. You know, that thing is insane. Oh my goodness. Let me see. Okay, so I'm gonna see if I could actually grab this little guy out. So of course, everybody say thank you to Audrey right there over here at my neighbor, helping me out. Of course, you know, she actually gave up the, the position of this little eel off of an iPhone video that she filmed this morning. It was very cool, it was very awesome. And you know, thank you to her. Everybody say in the comment section below, thank you, Audrey. Thank you so much, because it was actually pretty cool. Of course, I love you all, fam. And that is, of course, going to be the end of today's awesome video. I love you all, fam, and I'll see you guys in the next awesome, crazy adventure, too, of course. Feed Jaws.